So I've got it set up in the four jaw chuck. I've got it centered on this piece here, as close as I can get it, as close as you can get it with a piece of cast. I'm just gonna face that off just to get it flat. Uh, and then we're gonna put the 12 mil hole in. We've not really done much cast before, so I'm just gonna start off with a low speed and see where we go. Yep, I'll rub on there very nicely. Right, let's get the oil down here. Now, put this on and lift this up and get a mark. Voila! Oh, that looks smart. So we'll pull this up. I've got a bit of thread sticking out at the bottom, and you probably can't see that, but I've got a bit. So there's plenty of plate. I'll pull it up tight and put a mark. And hopefully, that's where we're cutting it. On that mark there. Yes, for the handle one, I'm just gonna use the drill. Uh, it's just a tapped hole. It's feeling quite flat on there, so we should get it quite square. Uh, I put a center mark as closest to the center of this round bit here. size shall we put in it that's the question Decided on an M10. We'll start with that. See how it goes. 
It was a bugger to get started though. <laughs> that has gone off rather quick. Right, I'll just let that go off a little bit. I'll go and make myself a brew. Come back and just give that a little face off there. Make it nice and smooth. And then I need to put a grub screw in. But that has gone. That's rock solid. Nearly 60% of the viewers on this channel have not clicked the subscribe button come on what are you doing click the subscribe button join in get participating because you never know when this steam engine's finished it may come to a railway near you you could miss out and not know about it because you didn't click the subscribe button and that notification bell join the fun you know you want to you know where else would you get to see somebody drinking tea on the internet To send your blooming dizzy that right so we want to put in a oh m6 i think That 
should do it. What this is going to do, because it's half on the stainless and half on the cast, this will stop it spinning if the Loctite ever breaks. There we are. That will never rotate. Still got a handle to make. We'll worry about that at a different time, but let's get this get this in here. And then we can see if it works. So if we roll it forward, she should roll backwards. There we are. Doesn't take much neither. And there's still, still levering it up. This looks okay down here. Oh my goodness. The trolley's moving. Oh my lord. I think that works. There we go, we now have some working brakes. I'm quite impressed. That's a lot of videos though we've done just to get here. It kind of shows you the basic principle, doesn't it, you know? But yeah, working brakes. And it doesn't take a lot of force neither to stop it rolling, which is quite surprising. Uh, I didn't expect that at all. I was expecting it to, to take quite a bit, but it'll probably be different once we've got the boiler on and the tanks and all the bodywork and everything else wrapped up, it's probably going to be a heavy lump. So it might need a bit more. Stay safe. Laters. Good video that, by the way. Click the subscribe button down below, notification bell. Click the like button. You know you want to.